What is up guys? It is your girl Caitlin here and welcome back to another Life Talks with Caitlin. And as you all know, right now what is going on in the world, in the United States, the coronavirus. And I know guys that you guys are probably tired of hearing about this, but I wanted to give my little two cents on what to do while you're bored during our stay at home quarantine because I know for me personally I'm doing um we're doing online school right now in my school so we can't go back to school so now we're doing all our classes online and I know that naturally it gets a little boring right so I came up with some things to do well not really came up with I got a list together of things that we should be doing and we can be doing right now as if you know, in the times that we are bored, we can do these things now. So, number one, growing our relationship with God. If you don't know Jesus, this is the best time for you to grow your relationship with him. And when you got saved, your relationship started then. So now, you just got to continue to maybe listen to sermons. Take this time to listen to sermons, read your word, and... um pray more right so growing our relationship our number two said the same thing is reading our bibles like for me you all know that i do bible plans and um you guys should start doing them too it's the bible app and you go in there you can choose whichever type of plan that you feel like you need to do right and the plans are designed to break down the lesson and to help you learn a lesson through whatever topic you chose using the word of god right and that takes us to our number three, prayer. Prayer is so important in this time. We need to be praying for the nation. We need to be praying for the world right now because there's something that God is doing and we need to have ears to hear him. So we need to be still in our prayer time, right? To be able to hear what the Lord wants us to know, right? And don't forget, he's already said mostly everything in his word already. So in the Bible, that's why we should read our Bibles in this time. Number four, I think I'm gonna think I'm on number four. But number four, spend some time with your family or the people that are around you. Whether it's roommates, um, family members, um, friends, spend some time with them. Grow a close relationship with them even the more. Learn their likes and dislikes. Learn, let them learn your likes and dislikes dislikes grow closer together you guys can even pray together you guys can um read the bible together in this time guys we should totally be doing these things so these are a couple things that i kind of thought about i was like what can we be doing while we're bored you know at home and stuff knowing that all these kids are doing online school and you know when the parents get home what can they be doing right so these are a couple of things that I thought about that we could be doing. And you guys always know that my DM is open. My message line is open. So you guys can always contact me on any of my social medias if you're bored and you want to start a Bible plan with me or if you want to um, ask me some questions, if you want to talk about anything, you guys know that my line is always, always open, right? And let me think, what else? Let's just say... So let's see what we covered. Prayer. Um, did I say worshiping God? Go into deeper worship. Sing your songs out loud. Mean what you're saying. Worship the Lord. Tell him how great he is. Thank him. Be thankful for this time that he is keeping us under the shadow of the Almighty. And our scripture for this time is definitely Psalms 91. I want everybody to go and read that and if, i know if you're already familiar with it go read it again because it's just a fresh a refresher a reminder of you know what's going on in the world right now and how those who dwell under the shadow under the shadow of the almighty so psalms 91 is your guys's scripture for this week and for the rest of these weeks always remember this scripture right so we covered worship um prayer Growing our relationship with God and spending time with our friends and family and the people around us. And let's just chill out and just do these things. Along with, for my students, my people still in school, still get your schoolwork done. And then whatever you want to do in the meantime, in your spare time, do it. But 
Grow your relationship with God. Pray way more. Worship way more. Maybe even go on walks. Let's add that. Go on a walk. Just browse your neighborhood. You know, just walk around it. And just get some fresh air. You know, go sit on the porch. Pray to God. Worship Him. Get in His Word, you know. And just live life. Our lives haven't stopped. They have not stopped. Live your life through Christ. At home. You can do these things. Listen to sermons. All kinds of things. You guys, I'm so excited about our journey. Still, still, still. And I know that the Lord has worked and is working everything out for our goods. So, all to my fellow Christians. I love all of you so, so much. Thank you so much for taking your time out to watch my video today. I love all of you, all my supporters, all my watchers. And you guys, stay safe out there. Stay safe. But remember, don't fear. There is a difference between being cautious and staying safe and fear. There's a total major difference. And never forget that. I love all of you so, so much. I hope you enjoy the rest of your week, kids. Hope you enjoy the rest of your online schooling and the rest of your week. I love all of you. Stay safe. Stay encouraged. You are amazing. God loves you. You are his everything. You're everything to him. Make sure he's your everything, too. All right, guys. I love all of you. I'm going to go take a walk with my mom just to get some fresh air, you know. Walk around the neighborhood. Walk by the... um the river because we live I um, mean not the river the yeah the river the, the river yes because we live by a river right so yeah we're gonna go walk down at the little sidewalk just walk by you know get some fresh air all right guys I love all of you stay safe I love you I love you I love you can't stress that enough I love you just like God loves you I love you with the love of God that he gives me to share with you guys <laughs> okay guys I love you all